Hello again, I'm Rodney Reynolds from 3dgameman.com. Please remember to support us at support3gm.com. This next question is about video card artifacting. Now, video card artifacting happens for a number of reasons, and it's usually the fault of the video card. It's a pixelated color mess on the screen. And if it happens to you, power down your computer system right away, then power it back up, and hopefully it will be gone. In most cases, it will be, because in most cases, it's related to a few things. Either your room temperature is too warm, uh, it should be normal, around 25 degrees Celsius. Um, maybe your case does not have proper air circulation, or maybe you do have lots of fans, but maybe the dust filters are all clogged up, so check all that and make sure there's adequate uh, air circulation throughout the case. And also, if you're overclocking, lower the overclock on the GPU and or the memory. The other issue, of course, is that it's a defective video card. Now, Mike has some issues here. He's um, Sometimes he's played for five hours plus of constant gameplay, and, and there's no artifacts. Sometimes it's just five minutes, and there's artifacts. Uh, he swapped out a power supply thing and tried a few other things, and also contacted EVGA, since this is an EVGA video card, and asked them about how to resolve this. But they have not, and he has not been able to resolve this. Um, so, might try all the things that I just mentioned. Um, it just might be a defective video card. I mean, it happens. Um, not very often, but it does happen. I've had artifacting happen almost um, every other video card that I review because I'm pushing them to the limit, uh, overclocking the GPU and the memory. And artifacts happen, um, but normally all you do is just reboot the computer system and they go away because in most cases it is related to an overclocking issue or um, a heat related issue. I hope this answers your question and keep your questions coming.